If you think that Christian persecution is funny, don't call yourself a Christian. You don't have to be in a box or in some type of lane of what people tell you to be in because they read the Bible and say, this is how you should act as a Christ follower. No, you take up space and you ride in the lane that God tells you to ride in. Don't be a coward. Don't be tolerant because God is not. And someone the other day that I met said that God was tolerant and I was like, no, he's graceful. He's merciful. He is not tolerant. Let's not give God labels because we want to feel comfortable, okay? Jesus wasn't sent here so we could feel comfortable. Jesus was sent so that we may have eternal life because he is our savior. But when you laugh at Christian persecution or when you are just on the sidelines saying, let me not say anything because I might upset or offend someone, don't call yourself a Christian. You can call yourself scared, afraid, and maybe you are. Maybe you should be, I guess. But if you are afraid, then I would really like to ask you, who's your God? Is it the world? Is it the enemy? Because if God is actually the ruler and the foundation of your life, there's no need to fear. There is no need to fear this world. There's no need to fear the enemy. Have discernment? Yes. But God didn't give you a spirit of fear.